All right, everybody, another update on the Raptor. Uh, the green strawberry uh, Raptor pilots I picked up uh, from uh, hot, um, HD Model Works. Uh, already worked on one figure, got them together, and uh, it looks really cool. A lot of detail to the figure being 3D printed. I, I'm impressed. It's really cool compared to what you get with the kit and uh, there's no comparison I mean uh, they're okay if that's what you got to use if you have the kit but if you can step it up and get the strawberry uh, green strawberry uh, co-pilots for the Raptor uh, I would suggest to go that way I have two more to put together uh, I am using super glue to put these guys together and uh, little clean up little time consuming probably gonna work on this guy next this this here you can see where I got to clean up between his legs and uh, like I did uh, this one here I had to clean them all up and a little little uh, had to use the file here to clean them up it's gonna be the same thing with this guy here because he's in two parts And you can see where on this arm here where I got to clean up right in here take that out and then clean it up with a exacto blade and it'll turn turn it'll turn out pretty cool I'll do all this off camera and then I'll eventually get around to painting these guys up uh, but I figured I'd give everybody an update what I got going on the bench with the Raptor I will be getting back on that too. I figured I'd just knock these guys out first, put them to the side, then I'll get back on the Raptor. So I'll go ahead and pause for now and talk with everybody later. All right, everybody, another update on the Raptor. Been working off camera on the three uh, uh, Raptor pilots that you can pick up, and I painted them. And. Uh, let everybody take a quick look. They turned out pretty decent for 3D printed uh, figures for 132 scale. They really look pretty cool. I still got to work on the helmets on two guys and their faces, but uh, it's just detail work. Same with the other one here. Looks pretty good. Turned out pretty decent. Same with this guy here. He sits in the back of the Raptor. See his face is still all black yet. I gotta paint his face up. He turned out pretty decent. And then I've been working on his helmet. The helmet uh, overall color is silver with gold uh, detail. I don't know if that's gonna pick up the camera here. But uh, Looking pretty good. I might need another coat or two of the silver before I apply the the gold. But looks pretty good. Over here on the Raptor, I've been working on that. I picked up these seats uh, from uh, Green Strawberry. I cleaned them up off camera. I have the two seats in the front here you can see. Uh, I know they're 3D printed. They're probably, you know, they had to have been uh, cleaned and all that. But I think I'm going to clean them with some Dawn soap before I apply any paint. Just to make sure. But you can see the front here, the cockpit area. Got it all jerry-rigged together. Just to turn on some power to show everybody where I'm at so far. The two rear panel uh, computer walls in the back of the Raptor. I eventually uh, did apply some glue and they're uh, together now so let me go ahead turn some power on I got it set at 9 volts so everybody can get a good look at the Raptor let me go ahead turn the overhead light off and uh, let everybody get a cool look at what I've done so far with the Raptor now it's been a month since I posted last I'm gonna to try to do my best to 
post something every couple weeks. I've uh, been sick again. And I'm trying to get over that. That slows me down some. But uh, you can see the front here. I got that looking pretty cool. And then the rear looks pretty awesome. Camera clears up. You can see that. Everything's looking pretty cool. And nothing in the back is going to blink. It's just not all going to be lit up. And that's good enough. It's going to look pretty cool. Once the raft is all done. This is a slow process. I still have some lighting to do in the front of the cockpit area. Um, let me point it out. Try to point it out. The very front right here. I don't have lit up. I've got two little... Uh, I drilled two holes right here in the center. I'm going to run maybe fiber optic. I'm going to have those two lights lit up there. Just to give some more detail and, and some lighting right in, in the front of the cockpit area. But you can see what I've done so far. It looks pretty cool. The seats from Green Strawberry really make it pop. It look really cool. Like I said when it's all together. Back of the raft, it does really look cool. And any light leaks, uh, I'll deal with that once I start putting this together and see if, if I have to do any more uh, touch up with the light leaks. But I think this one should be fine here. Same with the one on the opposite side. Uh, once the raptor's together, uh, We'll see, I might have to light block it in here. And the same with the other side. But for right now, I think it looks pretty cool. And I wanted to share this with everybody. And call this a wrap for part 5 of the 132 scale Colonial Raptor. I'll continue working on the Raptor. And I'll start posting hopefully more between than a month apart. I'll try to do my best on that. Like I said, I've been a little sick. And it takes uh, a lot of energy out of me to sit down here in my hobby room and uh, work on this. But I figured I'd share this with everybody. It's looking pretty cool. I'm going to go ahead and be quiet here for a second and let everybody get a closer look. And I'll go ahead and call us a wrap again for part five. Everybody be safe out there, and I'll talk with everybody later.